Hey everybody, so it's Sunday and it is 12.20 and I am totally upset because YouTube ate my video. Um, give me a second, hold on. Uh, whatever. Alright, I was just checking my email on my other computer. <laughs> um, so yeah, I did a whole video and YouTube just didn't upload it. It said publishing and it never published, so I'm just going to redo it. Um, so... I decided to do this video. It's not a haul video, so stop freaking out, people. Um, <laughs> um, yeah, no, this is going to be a video that I need to do before I forget to do it because I did it yesterday. It was a project that I did yesterday with my NYX cosmetics, at least my NYX singles. Um, and it took me about five hours, but what I did was I did a NYX palette. Um, for those of you who know NYX or buy mix, you know that if you buy too much, it kind of gets bulky just because of the way that the packaging is. You know, you got these thick little squares, whereas the eyeshadow is just smaller. So when you have, when you buy more than 10 or you have more than 10, it tends to take up a lot of space. So <clears throat> I, you know, these, these are the things that I store my cosmetics in. For the meantime but do you see how big how much space all these trios take now imagine this side completely full or filled with these right now I only have three left that are in this but um, it was completely like there was like three rows full filled with um, these little things um, so I have more than three. I have um, about 20 left. Uh, it's just in my train case. Um, <laughs> and the reason I didn't <coughs> the reason I didn't depot them was because I still have to do a haul video with um, all the latest NYX stuff that I got. Uh, so that's why I didn't depot them. <coughs> so um, I depotted uh, 40 shadows. Uh, yesterday it took me about five hours or whatever but what you do is you take a paring knife and you put it in this corner right here I don't know if you can see the corner uh -huh, right there yeah whatever so but you put it in this corner and then you try to pry the knife all the way in and then you move it wiggle it to the side and then push down and twist so that the top part of um, so this little part comes out it's melted that's why it looks so weird but then this is here so then you plop and then what you do is you put this part with the um, take some tweezers and hold it and then you put it over a candle and melt the plastic and you take some you take a needle and then pry out the little uh, can container or metal thingy and <clears throat> what you do what you do what you get is this little thing you know out of here and you gotta be careful because you can crack them if you're not um if you're not not safe but if you're not careful yeah so you can crack them look at how that one that one cracked ah there you go see how cracked it is and then others totally just broke into pieces and I had to like repress so I had to repress that one but you know you gotta be careful or else you're gonna crack a bunch of thing, a bunch of shadows um so then what you do afterwards is you put a magnet and a label on the back so you know what it is uh, so I depotted 40 and I bought a palette from stars makeup haven and um, <clears throat> I put them all in here with the magnet sheet. So that's what I got. Isn't it pretty? I think I'm gonna glue them down. Just the fact that you see the green one and the blue one kind of went down. I mean, they're all stuck because of the magnets, but I don't know. I need to do something because they're driving me nuts like that. Uh, but yeah. So there's 40 
uh, eyeshadows here. So you can imagine 40 of these little things in that container. Uh, so, like I said, I still have another one to do. Uh, I'll probably do it next week. I don't think I'm going to depot my next trios just because it took forever to depot the singles. So I can imagine the trios will probably even take longer. And my fingers were hurting after that. Um, and they're not as bulky as the as the singles. But I don't know. I guess I can depot those because they're circles. So they'll probably fit into one of the regular palettes and not have to take out the foam because with this palette I took out the foam so there would be more space um but yeah so that's what I wanted to share with you my NYX palette and I still have to decorate the the front part of it um I still have to depot and do my second hip palette um and put the magnets on the first one um, but I'll do that next week or whatever. Um, so I just wanted to share with that with you. And now I should be getting ready. Well, I'm already ready. Um, but I should be going to my graduation. It starts at 3, but I have to be there at 2. So it takes about an hour for me to get there. So I should leave at uh, 1 and it's 12.30. It's going to be 12.30, so I should be on my way. Um, I will do probably another haul video, not haul video, well yeah, another haul video next week, but uh, another tutorial, um, maybe tonight or maybe tomorrow, I have them done, I just have to edit them, and let's see, what else, oh, I like the tour, the, the tutorial, or the look that I did yesterday, the black and brown, I absolutely loved it, well, I'll keep wearing that one, and this one was kind of cool, so, hmm. I did, I'd use Stella products for this, and, um, I didn't do a tutorial, I didn't take any pictures or whatever, but, if you like it, just request it and I'll do it, but, you know, as of right now, I'm not gonna do it. <laughs> so, I will talk to everyone later, hopefully this video will upload quickly, because, um, YouTube was kind of acting funny. Uh, so, have a great Sunday, uh, go outside, enjoy the weather, because it is beautiful. And I will talk to you people later. Bye.